Hi there, it's Juliana. I always told myself to work out harder so I can eat more food. No jokes. It is really my biggest motivation. Eating is probably one of my favorite things in the world, and I've always wanted to share with you guys. So I recorded some of them. Here you're gonna see me eating Japanese and Korean cuisine. Hong Kong Cantonese food, also Chinese, Western, and Italian, and what's not. Because a lot of you are curious, I go for intuitive eating. When I kind of overeat though, I'll go for some detox, like eating more fruits, smoothie, and tea. I'm trying this detox starter pack with tea meat. It's been my fourth day of trying it, and so far it's been pretty good. Personally, I prefer the skinny tea bag over this one because that one tastes really good. So yeah, I will update you guys more. I also got a 20% off discount code for you guys. So um, I will link it down below. You guys can check that out. I don't know if you guys have tried it, eating or making okonomiyaki. This is so much fun. This one is mine. I've made the base and I'm gonna add the sauce. Oops, I failed. Okay, you know, best gonna know this is an art piece. <laughs> Some creamy cheese chicken rice, an Angus burger, and all day breakfast. I've seen this so many times on my Instagram stories, but this time I'm finally trying it myself. Harsh brown, my fave. I'm so happy because they gave us free ice cream. Take away sushi and sashimi. Sorry, please ignore the mess at the back. Mm, this is so good, by the way. sushi every single day and I'll get bored mm. oh, oh well my family is back stop filming and act natural <laughs> all right end of the day with Japanese lunch again this restaurant offers lunch sets with two mains, one salad, and a bowl of soup.
out for dinner. Cookie boiling, put everything in. Oh my god, did you see that? Oh my god. The cheese. A meatball. A dumpling. More, more meat. And some udon. Alright. Next day, lunch. A bowl of random vermicelli from the canteen. Some double pork, beef, and a mushroom. And then I went for pizza for that night. Chips, fried chicken, pizza, meatball pasta, and to the fried streams. Since yesterday meals were quite heavy, so today I'm gonna go for salad. Well, and a cup of boba, matcha boba. I was super busy today. It was already 1 a.m. when I got back home, so I didn't have time for dinner. So I had a dragon fruit. But the hunger had me dying. So I had a cup of yogurt after shower. Another busy day with takeaway. Vietnamese style. Still a bowl of vermicelli, but it tastes different. And some more Greek yogurt with honey. a Japanese supermarket and there was a food cart so I just ordered something for dinner Dave, food! Well, not too good looking Well, this veggie rice actually looks better Spicy sour fish Okay. It doesn't look good, but it tastes okay. Gosh, and 
this is so good I was still a bit angry, so I bought some sashimi for my supper. Orion. And a boba ice cream. By the way, I actually have so much more delicious food, but sometimes I just forgot to film it. Here are some of them. If you want to know what I eat every single day, follow my Instagram as well. It's also observe. Getting back, it's tea time. A Hong Kong style with false shark fin soup. There's no shark fins inside, but it's cold like that. It's yum, my childhood favorite. Fried chicken wings and a French toast with butter. style milk tea. Mm. I like a healthier dinner with two eggs, avocados, and some salad. my stomach started my next day with a healthier choice again a healthy bowl with tuna Japanese takeaway for dinner as well. Mm. I went back home with some Korean strawberries, natural yogurt, mix them with honey, and then strawberries. Whoops, please ignore my acne cream. Ooh, it looks good and it tastes good. And yeah, an avocado again. Mmm, I swear to god, it tastes better than what it looks. <clears throat> Orion. So at night, I went on a hike to the Lion Rock. This is how it looks under the night mode But um, as you guys can see, the quality is very bad I mean my camera <laughs> It's getting darker and colder You know what? Put my hoodie back on and time for dinner As it's too late, so we ordered some takeaway again Some sushi Spicy minced pork with eggplant And bingo pudding for dessert Delicious and low calories. All right, avocado again, but this time we're drinking it. How? Make it a smoothie. 
very simple, just an avocado, some milk, and a bit of honey or brown sugar. Mm. Cheers! So, so, so much more to share with you guys, but I guess I am speaking a little bit too much here. So, I'm gonna make a part two if you guys would like to watch. Let me know in the comment section what do you think. And if you like this video or any of the food here, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Bye!